We want all of our students to graduate with a degree that they will value, that employers will value, and will prepare them for the rest of their careers. And we imagine uh, and are moving towards experiential learning as a key component to that. I'm really passionate about the environment. So I'm looking into renewable energy systems and the development of new technologies. When I get to see how fuses react to transient currents, it reminds me that my equations and that my long nights of studying actually do matter and it does have an effect on the world. I'm working with Dr. Nate Don Barnett on the FAFSA completion project and FAFSA is just what we all have to fill out to go to college in order to receive financial aid. Now in the scholarships, there are literally millions of dollars out there just floating around for you guys to go get. I really enjoy the outreach and the communication with the students, and I think it's really just to help me to grow and to help to bring the Buffalo Schools communities together as a whole. I am a Grow WNY intern, um, which means I work primarily on the website for the Western New York Environmental Alliance. You're dealing with people who are doing real things in the real world and it kind of sets a sight for you on what you can do in the future. The substantial um, international experience is designed so that the students are able to uh, understand that the world is round and they're meant to go around it and that there are fabulous cultures and languages uh, out there to explore. The context of the trip was community development, so that was our focus. And Tanzania being a third world nation, they're Poverty is real there. It was life-changing for me. I realized that happiness isn't about what you have, it's about what you have to share with others. The trip that I went on this spring break um, was to the Dominican Republic. You don't realize that you're learning when you're participating in a trip like this, but when you really stand back and look at it, you are learning. The world is getting more interconnected, and, and it's hard to live in isolation these days. And the way that you can appeal to employers and to graduate schools and professional schools is to show that you have begun to take advantage of all the global opportunities that exist. In 1623, there were about 750 of these Shakespeare first folios printed, and around 230 still exist faculty are at the university uh, in order to engage with students and so the best way to get involved in experiential learning or in international experiences to go knock on doors and begin to ask questions. I really like teaching and mentoring students at different levels. We nurtured them with the experience, not only the theoretical knowledge but the practical experience that they need. The best way to learn is not from a textbook, it's through experiences. Experiential learning is really important because it just re-inspires you, it gives you a purpose. Like, I am so determined now, I know what I want to do.